Hi, in today's video, I am going to show you how to create a bootable USB for Windows 11 version 25H2 using the latest version of Rufus. If your PC won't boot or has system errors, you can use the USB to access Windows recovery environment. From there, you can repair startup problems, run system restore, use command prompt for advanced fixes, and reinstall Windows without losing your files. It's super easy, just follow along step by step and you will have your installation USB ready in a few minutes. So let's get started. First, we need three things. The official Windows 11 25 h to ISO file. I have already downloaded so I am not doing it again. Latest version of Rufus, go to rufus.ie and download the latest version of Rufus. Just click the download link under latest release. It's a small file. I have already downloaded so I am not doing it again. And an empty USB flash drive, at least 16 GB of capacity. Next, plug in your USB drive at least 8 GB. Though I recommend 16 GB just to be safe. Open Rufus and you will see your USB drive automatically appear under device. If it doesn't, unplug it and plug it back in. Click select, then browse and choose the Windows 11 25H to ISO. Rufus will automatically detect the version and show you a few customization options specific to Windows 11. Now choose the partition scheme based on your PC. Select GPT if your system uses UEFI or MBR if it's an older BIOS system or press Alt plus E key combination for both BIOS or UEFI. Everything's ready, just click start. Here's the cool part. With newer Rufus version, you can actually tweak the Windows setup to skip annoying restrictions. You will see options like Remove TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot Requirement Remove RAM Limit Create a local account automatically Skip data collection screens If you are installing on older hardware, Make sure to tick the remove TPM and secure boot box. Note, if you plan to install Windows on multiple PCs, I recommend keeping those Rufus tweaks on. That way, you will have a universal installer that works on almost any hardware. Then click OK. And Rufus will warn you that all data on the USB will be erased. Click OK and let it run. This usually takes 5 to 10 minutes, depending on your USB speed. When it's done, you will see ready at the bottom. And that's it, your bootable USB is done. To use it, restart your PC and press your boot menu key. Usually F12, F9 or Escape and boot from your USB drive. From there, just follow the Windows 11 setup as usual. And that's it, your Windows 11 25 h to bootable USB is ready. If this video helped you out then drop a like and subscribe for more tech tips. And comment below if you ran into any issues. Thank you, thanks for watching, have a nice day.